Well, good morning, everyone. It's so good to be back. Uh, it's very nice to see you all. I'm with Michael. That after party sounds really good. I didn't get a chance to say hello to everyone. I want to start with saying a deep thank you to all of our staff and physicians back at the medical centers and across our medical office buildings. These past two years have been unprecedented and very difficult on our staff, but they have risen to the occasion magnificently. They are our heroes, so thank you to all of them. Well, we are so thrilled that the state, of Sac the state of downtown is back in person this year, and we're honored once again to be the event's presenting sponsor. That video that we watched was just fantastic. It really reminds us of how far we've come in transforming Sacramento's core into a vibrant city center, and now a destination for fine dining, sports, art, and entertainment. It's also become home to high-quality health care. As Kaiser Permanente to, uh, continues in more than a billion-dollar capital investment just blocks from where we're gathered here today, you right, might remember that when Kaiser launched its investment in 2015, we committed to doing so in a way that would bring good health to downtown. We started fulfilling this promise the very next year by opening up the Sports Medicine Center located in our, our beautiful arena. This groundbreaking facility in the Golden One Center has been called the gold standard of sports medicine by the commissioner of the NBA. It now provides outstanding care to our own Sacramento Kings and weekend warriors alike. In 2018, we opened up our downtown Commons Medical Office building at uh, Fifth and J, which added 500 jobs to our local economy and provides outstanding care and service to the thousands of Kaiser Permanente members who live and work in downtown and beyond. And in the future, we will add to our investment by building a state-of-the-art hospital on the 18 acres we own in historic rail yards. This expansion of medical services to the downtown is unprecedented, but our commitment to a healthy downtown does not stop with the care that we provide behind the walls of our buildings. We are also committed to ensuring that this expansion results in the improvement to the health of our surrounding community as well. Thank you, Trish. One of the ways we're doing just that is through our Family Medicine Residency Program is training uh, new physicians to not only provide outstanding patient care, but also care for the community as well. Based out of our downtown Commons Medical Office, this three-year program is training some of the best and brightest new physicians from across the country right here in downtown Sacramento. With the growing shortage of family medicine physicians in the nation, this program could not be more valuable or timely. For these six doctors currently in our inaugural class, their hands-on curriculum includes caring for Kaiser Permanente members in our hospital and clinics, as well as robust engagement in our own community. Our expectation is that they will work to identify health disparities and use their training and talents to help address them. Their work can be seen through unique partnerships with WellSpace Health and Community Care Health Center, where they're helping provide medical care to the underserved in our local community. It is also inspired by their own personal passion, life experiences, and desire to make downtown Sacramento a better, healthier place to live for all. Such is the case for Kendra Vieira, a graduate of UC Berkeley, Go Bears! <laughs> and the UC Davis School of Medicine. As a member of the LGBTQ plus community in Sacramento, Kendra was familiar with the many grassroots organizations and support systems in our region, but could not find a comprehensive guide that included all of them. As part of her community medicine requirement, 
Kendra took on an initiative to compile an LGBTQ plus resource guide that lists more than 40 agencies and organizations uh, focused on supporting the needs of this, uh, this community. This guide is now being used to help healthcare providers uh, become familiar with the resources of the LGBTQ plus community and demonstrate to patients that we're sensitive and responsive to the complicated challenges that they face. In addition, we have a new program starting next month. Well, we, well, we will be partnering with the uh, Latino Leadership Council uh, to outreach our city's most vulnerable Latinx residents, a community currently experiencing some of the most significant health disparities in our own city. Working through our Salud en Español program, residents and medical students will learn about environmental and social determinants of health and work to provide bilingual care in a culturally responsive setting. Partnering with the uh, Latino Leadership Council, they will uh, make home visits to those in need, tackling COVID-19, diabetes, mental health, homelessness, and other issues that are challenging uh, this community. I am proud that Kaiser Permanente is training these future leaders to develop new and innovative ways to address the health disparities of our community and bring good health to downtown Sacramento. Thank you, Dr. Tango. The work that, yes, I love that. The work that these residents are doing is truly inspiring and underscores the responsibilities we all have to do our part. Because in the future, the success of downtown re revitalization will not only be measured by how many buildings have been built and businesses opened, it will also be measured by how well we've addressed the health needs of our downtown's most vulnerable in the process. We have a lot of work to do, but we look forward to partnering with each one of you to ensure that this vision becomes a reality. And at Kaiser Permanente, we are very grateful for the partnership we have with our next speaker. Mayor Daryl Steinberg, one of Sacramento's most accomplished public servants, has led with his heart in serving the Sacramento community for more than 20 years. As mayor, Daryl has not shied away from these challenges that face downtown, whether it be homelessness, civil unrest, or economic development. He has a passion for Sacramento and has fought and secured significant resources to tackle these challenges head on. Kaiser Permanente has been a proud partner of Mayor Steinberg on many fronts over the years, and we're grateful for his support and partnership as we work collectively to bring good health to downtown. Please welcome me, enjoying, uh, join, uh, welcoming Oh, here. I See, I great Richard. I did so good until the end. <laughs> Two years, folks. Please join me in welcoming Mayor Daryl Steinberg. Thank you. 